Hey YouTube, the Robot Fox here, and today I finally got my hands on this guy, Studio Series number 60 Scrapper. Now, I legit went through hell just to get this guy. It was not easy. Also, Sentinel's review will be coming tomorrow morning. Or at least for me, it'd be in the morning. Yeah. Now, let's off with a few details. Hold on, it's trying to come apart again. Alright, uh, let me fix it up. Let me fix them up a bit. Okay, well, got them fixed up a bit. Front, side, back, side, bottom, top. Articulation on the thingy itself. He, he has this. Yeah. Now, to transform this guy into, uh, the arm, you gotta update these, and rotate them around, and with these, uh, these bad boys, th this, there's something right here, not sure if you can see it, right here, uh, it goes into a little slot that's on the bottom of Scrapper. Same on the other side. Got that going on. Then you close this down. Do that. Do that. And now here you have Scrapper in his arm mode. Just adjusting things. Oh wait. First, flip these out. Now, here you have Scrapper in his arm. Yeah, arm. Very awesome arm. Very nice fingers. Uh, this is a really heavy duty ratchet joint. I'm not sure if you could hear that, but it makes like a metallic sound when you try to move it, which is very cool, very, very cool. Uh, something else you could do is kind of adjust these fingers to, you know, kind of go more in the middle like that. Kind of looks like a little face right here, kind of. I don't know. I don't know. Now to transform it into his robot mode. Untab the legs from the, the Devastator post. And then you just pull these down and flip this out. And then continue to push that out, flip this down, flip this around. This slot right here will go into here. Just clips in easily like that. And then, uh, wait, and it goes like that. Got a leg done. And same on the other side. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, right. Flip that around. Peg that in. Flip that out. Boom, you got two legs done. Take the arm section. Split the arms, wait, flip that down, well flip, flip it up, as whatever you do. Take the arms, take them up all completely apart. Wait a minute, there's something wrong here. Oh, flip the legs around, that's something that I did. I noticed that the arms were on the wrong side, I'm like, what? Okay, well, on the home stretch, flip that down like that. Take the assembly that the Devastator hinges on, flip it down, wait, before you do that, take this heavy duty ratchet joint, do that, oh wait, before you finish up do that, you gotta flip his chest down, flip his head out, and then just do that, and then fold and then this just 
it kind of just goes in like that. And then the arms, they just tab in very, I can't really say securely, but good enough. It's good enough. Now it's just all of a matter of getting things adjusted. Uh, uh, okay, here you have Studio Series number 60, Scrapper. It looks fantastic. Now I'm only doing articulation because I have a perfect amount of time to do it. Okay, arms, they they should be able to do a 360, but it's blocked by that. Uh, arms can go in and out, up to here, and there's a hinge right here, well, a hinge right there, hinge right here, and a hinge at the hand for transformation all right other arm it's a bit different hinge right here hinge right here same thing and then that and then these thingies can move in leg can go as far up as that leg up and can go like that can go like that Knees, not much articulation because something's stopping it. I'm not sure what is. Uh, articulation here. And that's it for articulation. Oh, wait. Head. The head can move side to side, up and down because of the neck. Okay. Well, that is Scrapper. Here you have Studio Series number 60, Voyager Class Scrapper. This was not easy to get. It took a really long time for me to find it, but in the end, I did find it. So now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and tomorrow I'll be uploading Sentinel Prime's review. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.